guys. How's everybody doing? Hope everybody's doing well. You know me, I'm Tom. Okay. This is a huge upfit job, plus painting. I had to do all the hardware. They were all brass, so I had to change everything to, of course, that dark black. Got the whole room taped up. Got my three gallons here. And this place has already been painted, but the homeowner knows me real well and told me, Tom, I want you to paint this house. Now, of course, I've got the tape exactly on the 90 degree, and what these guys did, you can already see it from here, they took the trim paint and bled it into the wall. So where the tape is exactly in the 90 degree is the trim. And the white you see is how they floated the trim paint into the wall. You can see the variants, you know, some got tight and then a lot of it was pretty loose, pretty slack. It's over, way over, and it's not correct. You can see it. And there's a couple spots. I know there's a lot of green here, but you can just see where they made mistakes, where they actually, um, painted the wall, that little spot, see it right there. Not a big deal, but it's just noticeable. And then you can see the big float right through there. See, it's just not right. It's not perfect. And she wants me to make it perfect. So, she wants me to change this color too. Plus, this is a flat paint. This is flat in here, but this is all semi-gloss. And she wants me to stay with semi gloss because I told her you can see that shine on that wall, man. I said it's very difficult to take flat paint and paint it over semi gloss. I said you need to, this is a shower area, you need to go ahead and keep it in semi gloss. So, got two gallons of semi gloss. Plus, I got to hang two mirror here, mirror here, but I'll do that later. Put all the hardware on. Okay, all the hardware knobs and this is one of three upfits for this month and I'm getting this one started today you can see all that all the hardware has been changed this door had a problem so I pulled the trim off of it um, it was all messed up had a big hole in it so I'm just gonna put a new piece of trim there put new hardware on it reset the door Hung the TV. All the hardware on the cabinets. And she's missing one. We needed 20 out here and there's 21 drawers. I think she just undercounted. But you can see all this. Pretty slick. Plus there was a big problem with this door. You can see sunlight through here. So when I redid all the hardware, um, I, re, I re, re basically reset the door on the inside these hinges and it drew the door in tighter and then I put a shim up there and it worked perfect. Okay. All right. It'll probably take me two days to paint because it's going to take me a while to uh, tape these uh, three rooms up. There's actually another little small bathroom I didn't show you. So you got a master, a hallway, a master bath, and then a small toilet area. That's that's the other little room I didn't show you. Is the toilet area, plus putting all these light, uh, uh, these this brat, this new uh, dark hardware, taking all the brass hardware off, and just switching out all the locks, every single door handle, every single light cover, everything. Plus, the way I like to do business is, uh, I wanted to show you something. When you're really organized with your customers, they'll literally. Give you a punch list with your name on it. Say, Thomas, do all these things. Okay? Do all these things. And I wrote a bunch of notes when I met her. All the new sets of keys. Okay. All right. Sorry, I haven't done a video in about a week. Um, been up to the farm a, a lot. And because things now are growing up there, I brought back a bunch of watermelon, cantaloupe. Uh, corn, 
uh, zucchini, a huge zucchini, my God. Um, cucumbers. I've got a bunch of passion fruit growing. I must have about 20 or 30 of those that are growing. And plus the weather has been great. We've had some rain. I did a lot of domestic stuff at the house, cleaning up laundry, uh, vacuuming, uh, scrubbing all my toilets and, you know, uh, bathtubs and showers and, you know, the glass and cleaning up outside because I've been neglecting my own home <laughs> for the last 30 days. So, uh, but no big deal. I caught it all up. And I just wanted to say sorry, I haven't done a video in about a week. I've had a lot of topics I could have, you know, definitely done videos on, but uh, I don't like to get too repetitive. So 